Happy Monday, my Sleeping EV family, and welcome back to another mailbag video. So, I have an interesting giveaway that I won over the past week, and uh, it's really cool, and I actually can't wait to put it up in my room. So, this came from Blink Woods. I'll have the Twitter down below. He also has an Etsy shop, too. So, this came from Blink Woods. Uh, Binks Woods, Binks Woods, my apologies. It is a Mewtwo carving that I won, which is super, super cool. It's really, really cool. He does do carvings of uh, other Pokemon too. Did one for Eevee, which was really awesome. I would have no idea where to put it at the moment, but it looks super cool and maybe one day I can get one <laughs> if I have a place to put it. This size was actually perfect for me. I may think about getting one of an Eevee that's like carved like that. Cause I really do like wood carvings like that Mewtwo. I have something in my room that's Harry Potter that's a wood carving as well. I like smaller things. So maybe I'll go for an Eevee one like that and put it with my other Pokemon stuff. So, <laughs> but we do have a little bit of mail today and mostly trades. We have a couple of purchases, which we'll get into right now. So <laughs> this first one is from Aunt Anthony. <laughs> and this one's pretty awesome. Let's see. I like these. I want to use these more, have a reason to use those. And this is a Rainbow Greninja and Zorark. Zorark being a Pokemon I really like, as I do like dark types, and Greninja being paired with it since Greninja knows dark type moves as well. I know I'm probably gonna get some comments, but I think it's also dual type dark, if not solid water. But I know it did get in uh, Terra Raids recently with in Scarlet Violet, and it had a poison type, I believe. But another tag team to add to my collection. I'm actually finding quite a few of them. Um, and I'm definitely trying to go after more of the alt arts, but trying to snag up those full arts and regular tag teams as well as some rainbows is awesome too. Okay, this next one is from Gannon Miller. Here. These are actually going to be some vintage cards, some older ones. And looks like he sent some extras. Matang, a Doduo, that's a crease on there, but it's a base set Doduo, a Chatot, an adorable Doduo that is super cute. All these will go in vintage binders or in my. Uh, cute card binders <laughs> and a lick a tongue. I'm going to put that doe doo on top. That one's super adorable. Let me find that one again. <laughs> and we will stick those right there off to the side. And those are actually just some extras. The ones I did get were this, this Charmander e-reader, which is super adorable. This drowsy because uh, Coolidge has said that this is usually my face. <laughs> with certain things, uh, I think such as like Pokemon cards or Pokemon pops. <laughs> it just reminded me of him whenever he mentioned that. Munchlax, Ralts, which will go into my Gardevoir collection. War Turtle, being that I really do love War Turtle. This adorable Growlithe e-reader. Absol, an older Absol that I really liked. Blaine's Growlithe, and then some more extras. Eldegoss, Radiant Silix, and Cramorant. We will set those over here as well. Thank you so much for all those extras. That was amazing. <laughs> I, I didn't anticipate that many extra cards. I was just happy to get those <laughs> that I did. So thank you so much. Okay, next we have the trace. And the first one is from More33. And I traded for a Bennett and a Rare Candy. So I think we're gonna have all the cards that we need today to finish 
scarlet violets. So <laughs> I'm super, super excited. And those two I think needed to go in there and I know there's more of them. So this might be the big, the big one that I needed. This one is from Connor Herring. And uh, this, if I can open, is, yes, this is the big one that I needed. It is the Maridon EX <laughs> uh, SIR, the Special Illustration Bear. With the cute dots bun right there, this is the only one that between Coolidge and I, we could not pull. So... I did trade, I think, one of my Miriams for it, which was really, really awesome. So thank you so much for trading with me. And I see the Glaceon behind there is an extra that you sent as well. And I appreciate that. <laughs> Cause that is the last like big illustration rare that I needed. But I know we have more, so we're gonna keep going. And this one is from Jeremy. And I believe this one is yet another truth. Well, they're all trades, but it is a full heart Zamazenta from the base set that I was looking to get. I'm actually hunting down the Zacian as well. So we will actually get, try to find that Zacian too. I, uh, trying to collect the Zamazenta and Zacian cards. I think I just need the full art Zacian and, uh, I should have all of them. <laughs> wanted to collect just kind of the full arts there and the golds I got those as well okay so next one is from Aaron and this is sent in an interesting way this is about an interesting way you can send a PWE it's got cardboard on the inside as well as it being in a bubble mailer so I appreciate the extra protection that was taken there with that that is a very unique way to send something in a uh, envelope. And I appreciate it. <laughs> and this is one of the other Scarlet Violet ones I needed. It is the Palmont with Absol. I believe I traded for both of those. I'll put those uh, into the binder. The Palmont is, is, I was especially happy it got an art rare right out the gate. Uh, I love Palmont so much. Uh, Coolidge actually got me a shiny, and I need to adjust its moveset in Scarlet Violet. So it is a really good raid mod. I just don't have the right moves yet. Everything else is ready to go. I love shiny Palmont. It is adorable. <laughs> okay, and this next one is from John. And John has sent me the very last one I needed so we can put the binder together. Actually, no, there's one more. There's one more. So Vaporeon is an extra, which is a non hollow from Jungle. And John sent me the Curlia, the Curlia art rare. It is uh, one of the couple of art rares didn't, wasn't able to pull. Um, funny enough, the Ralts line is actually quite difficult to pull. I've only pulled Ralts and I only pulled Gardevoir. I did not get to pull Curlia, which, interesting. I I'm, will still be opening up some Scarlet and Violet. Kind of hoping I can find Curlia, not to replace or anything. I'm just intrigued now at how difficult that card is to pull. So. <laughs> but yeah, we have a, one more trade. Um, these are both from Gen Mint Club. He yeah. has sent me two different ones. Uh, I actually needed some reverses, which I think these are the reverses. Yes. So, Jim and Club sent me the last of the reverses I needed from Scarlet and Violet. And there is their card. And in this top loader are Quackaval. A uh, small of card number 20 and Heracross. Those are the last of the reverses, and you guys will see them when I put them in the binder at the very end of this video when you see the finished one. So that was the first uh, one of the ones Jim at Club sent, and the other one 
is this beautiful card. I get it open. And I appreciate the packaging in this too. So let's see. Got another. <laughs> I like the inserts. <laughs> okay. Oh, I got Toxicroak EX, uh, Bombardier. So I knew there were more that were still in there. And Dollop. So these are the last ones I needed. And I also sent a. Uh, Rainbow Zusu as well. So that's really cool. I will be adding all those to the binders. <laughs> and uh, we will put these right over here. Yeah, you guys can see them. <laughs> so that is super, super cool. A lot of Scarlet Violet cards today. Not as many tag teams. I think I still have one more. And we got a variety of just vintage cards as well. And then this one is a trade I did with Misty, Alpha Wolfie art. And Misty sent over one of the last, actually. And she put a note in there as well. We trade cards pretty often. <laughs> and she sent me one of the last shinies I needed, which was the uh, Hatina. I believe it was the Hatina. I will have to double check that I needed. Uh, Curly at Emeralds, which I actually have a Gardevoir that has this on here too that goes with it. So I will be hunting the Ralts to also uh, go with this card. There's one more, forgot about this one. This Delta Species Ralts, which is super adorable with these flowers. And these two uh, vintage, Japanese vintage cards. Uh, Hollow Azumarill from Neo Era and Hollow Articuno from Fossil. So those are some amazing finds that she found. And I traded her a couple cards as well. She will likely have them posted up on her Twitter if you guys want to see what I traded her. We're just trying to help each other finish some sets. I think I sent her some Scarlet and Violet and a couple of full arts from other sets as well. So. But the last card <laughs> is actually a gift, and I plan to send him something back to, is from Haiji. <laughs> uh, he reached out and asked if I collect tag teams, probably because he's been watching and seeing I'm snagging quite a few tag teams as of late, which I'm trying to collect them. I've gone a little bit more uh, hardcore into getting some of these tag teams. Just snagging up a few here and there and he actually had one I did not have and he decided to send it to me which was very very nice of him thank you so much hobby <laughs> and it is the Pikachu and Zekrom promo from the tin that you can get it is a super super amazing card oh, I love the artwork on this one and I know there's a couple more promos for those tins I don't have. I think the uh, Garchomp and Giratina is one of them. The other could be the Venusaur one, maybe. <laughs> but I should have almost all these tag team promos and it is super, super awesome. I love the artwork, I love the choice. And I think during this time, during the time when this card was actually in rotation, it was pretty powerful. So thank you so much, Javi, for sending me this card. You absolutely did not have to. And it's a step closer to getting all of the tag team cards for sure. And we will set that one over here. Actually, you can't really see it. That's a little better. <laughs> but hopefully you guys enjoyed today's Mailbag Monday. We got such a variety of cards, mostly heavy hand and scarlet violet, but that is because we are finishing that set. So if you would hit that like button, and if you are not yet subscribed to the channel, hit that subscribe button as well. We're trying to get there, trying to get to 1000 subscribers by the end of the year. I'm hoping we can do it, so. But let us check out the finished scarlet and violet base set binder. So here's the finished binder. I realized some of the reverses are not quite in here, 
but I know I do have them because Coolidge actually has them in his possession. But it's okay, we're gonna reorganize the, the binders, all of the master sets, so that we can see all the cards. We're gonna end up putting the reverses to the end, which is fine. I, I kind of would rather do that. <laughs> but all of the EX cards are in here, all of the regular rares, all of the hollow rares, all of the reverses, every card from the set is in here or will be in here. <laughs> and uh, there's it, this is so much fun. I'm still having fun opening up the base set. I hope everybody is too. <laughs> And then we got all of our art rares, all of them here. And the reason why there's blanks here, the starlies here, but we're trying to fill up down here some starlies, and we're trying to fill up an entire page of starlies. So we're working on that. We're missing seven to have one here, and then an entire page here. And then we got all of our full arts here, full art trainers. These are the special illustration rares. I have all those in card savers. Ooh. <laughs> it's knocked over. We got our golds. Those are the two golds there. And then I got all the promos from everything that I've opened so far. So this is so fun. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, watching me open up stuff to complete this set. Just watching me build this binder. So again, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. And as always, take care, sleep well, and good night.